Now we are successfully able to insert the product inside the database and also we have got the message. But I don't want the message in this way. We have to give some stylings and we have to display the message here. And also I should be getting cross symbol. When I click on that cross symbol, that message box should disappear. Now we are going to work on that. I will right click on this index.php and I am just going to close all the files. Now instead of displaying this, instead of displaying only product inserted successfully, I will be creating one variable. I will write here display message is equal to this one. I will copy same variable and inside this I am just going to paste. If this product is inserted successfully, I have to get product inserted successfully or else I should be getting there is some error in inserting product in inserting the product okay this message i just want to display now this message i want inside this container below this container i'm going to write one comment i will write here message display and i will be writing php code and i will be closing php code because we want to get this display message variable which is present inside our php so again, I'm just going to open PHP and here I will just close this PHP syntax. Inside this, I will again check if is set, if my message variable is displayed or if it is set, only then I have to display the message or else I should not display the message. Inside this, I'm just going to write echo. Before writing inside this PHP, here I will be creating one diff. Because when we write inside PHP, we will not be getting exact colors and everything manually we have to type. Here I will give one class, display message. And inside this diff container, I am just going to create one span pack. And also I will be closing span. Inside span, I just want to display this message. Okay, later on I will be displaying the message when we write the code inside this PHP code. And everything I am just going to convert into single quotes. And after this span, I want the cross symbol to close this container. And below this, I will write FAS dot FA times. Using this class, we will be getting the cross symbol. And when I click on this, so we are going to use this on click event. When I click on this, the entire section should disappear. So I will be writing this dot parent element. Okay, this is the concept of JavaScript. Parent element is nothing but this one. Okay, this is the parent of i. So this dot parent element dot style dot display. I should just hide this one. So I will be writing here none. Now you can see here I have used single quotes. So again I cannot use single quotes. Instead I will be using X. And here I will be closing single quote semicolon. And also here I will be using single quotes. Okay this is the container diff I have just given one class. Inside this we are having span where we are going to display the message. We have created the cross symbol. And whenever I click on this, this I parent that is our div should be hidden. So I have given here none. I will copy this. I will cut from here. Now inside this echo, double quotes. And I am just going to paste my entire code. Now inside span, I just want to display this message. I will copy. And here now I have to concatenate. I will write here single quote dot paste. Again, I'm just going to concatenate with that. I will save this. Refresh. Now I'm just going to insert the product headphone. Choose file. Select headphone. Open. Add product. Now you can see I got product inserted successfully. Instead of concatenating, it is just displaying me that. Let me remove. And also from here, I'm just going to remove. I will save this. 
now i'm just going to refresh now again i'm going to insert earpods open add products now you can see product inserted successfully now when i click on this it is just going to disappear now we have displayed the message next we are going to work on few more functionalities inside the project